Stephen Mulhern has been a staple on TV for almost three decades, although he opts to keep his romantic life out of the limelight. Recently, ITV star Stephen Mulhern sparked rumors he was dating this morning's Josie Gibson after the pair were seen holding hands. The pair were spotted together after filming the last episode of Ant and Dec's Saturday Night Takeaway. However, it looks as though their relationship is platonic. When asked about their status, Josie quipped to Mail Online, I'm in love with Stephen Mulhern. There you go, but, story of my life, I don't think he loves me. It seems as though Stephen hasn't publicly had a girlfriend since 2008 when he dated EastEnders actress Emma Barton, who plays Honey Mitchell. The pair called it a day on their relationship back in 2011. A few years ago, the 47-year-old confessed his working schedule makes it hard to date, before making a candid confession. Speaking to celebs now, he said, last time I went on a date was about four years ago. That makes me sound really sad. I need a life. I need to stop working so much. Admitting his best friend met a girl online, it doesn't look like fans will find Stephen swiping right. He continued, I think it's a bit weird someone from the TV doing online dating. I think ITD be bizarre. Confessing that his relationship with Emma had come to a natural end, it's unknown if there has been anyone special in Stephen's life since the breakup over a decade ago. Despite a seemingly quiet love life, Stephen has close friendships with many of his celebrity friends, especially the Geordie duo Anton Deck. The trio have been friends for decades after first meeting when Ant and Deck were doing SM, TV Live and Stephen at CITV. Touching on their bond, he told OK. Our friendship off-screen is just as wonderful as on-screen. We support each other, we're there for each other. However, it's not just Ant and Deck he's got a close bond with, as he's openly praised his friendship with Holly Willoughby and Emma Willis as well. Stephen revealed that if he needs advice, they're the people he'd turn to. At the start of the year, ITV fans got a glimpse of Holly and Stephen's friendship when he joined her to host Dancing on Ice, replacing Philip Schofield. Speaking about joining the show at the time, he told The Sun, I'm definitely doing the whole series. Of course, next year I'd love to do it. Also bizarrely out of all the shows, strictly, I'm a celeb, if I was a contestant I've always wanted to go on that. Because I've always wanted to ice skate. This wasn't the first time they worked together as fans may remember they hosted Ministry of Mayhem in 2004.